Hello everyone, welcome to Whiteup Channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can enable cookies on your MacBook Pro M3 or any MacBook you have. And then let's uh, fire up uh, Safari and then what we're going to do, we're going to actually go and press on our keyboard command plus common. And uh, now if you click on your keyboard command plus comma, as I said, here you're going to open settings and you're going to open settings for which app you actually select. If you select Safari, you're going to open settings for Safari. So command plus comma, you can also see here the shortcut or the, yeah, the shortcut visually exactly what I'm pressing on. And here guys, if you click on privacy here, you should see hide. You can actually click on advanced settings and then here, <clears throat> excuse me here in privacy you can hide your ip you can uh, about change we can see here for our uh, we have uh, options related to advanced options we have extensions we have um, website we have uh, privacy so for privacy we can click on here hide ip track uh, tracker only manage website data we can remove here this is uh, this website has stored data and you can click on one of the datas here and uh, just click on it and click on remove or just remove all now the things that you can do is here you can change file download location tabs uh, out of field password search security and privacy you can also prevent cross-site tracking uh, and also here website data as i showed you and uh, about we can check here also the about website profiles extensions and advanced and uh, here and now to actually prevent so we're going to have to actually click on this button right over here, prevent cross tr uh, site tracking, because when you're doing this, before, because <clears throat> this is actually a Safari privacy setting that limits how websites can track your online activity. And when you actually click on uncheck this, <clears throat> when you check this, you, you click, uh, you're clicking off or you toggle that off, this will disable uh, limitations on website tracking. This websites can potentially track your browsing activity across the web. So it disables limitations on website tracking. Now, if you actually uh, click on this on, limits then websites tracking across different sites, protects your privacy to some extent, and uh, why you might uh, click it off. So some websites might rely on cross site tracking to function properly. So the disabling could actually cause issues like having to log in repeatedly or features not working properly. Now in some cases, target advertising based on your browsing habits can be can be convenient. For example, if you are looking at running shoes on one website, you might see ads for running shoes on another website. So now also things guys to consider before clicking off. So privacy concerns when you allow cross-site tracking, websites can build on a comprehensible profile on your interest and online activity and other things. But <clears throat> if your goal here is to just to turn off or just to enable cookies, uh, you just have to prevent to uncheck this. That's what you have to do. Uh, so yeah guys just uncheck prevent cross-site tracking and i hope you found this helpful